is there any advice for people who might be sitting in, in their apartment or, you know, in their house right now with somebody they're in a relationship with, but not happy with that, and but are too afraid to take that step forward? Because, uh, you know, a lot of times what's happening is they end up letting the, their partner cheat on them or get away with things that they probably wouldn't normally because they don't want to start over. Do you have any advice for them? Yeah, totally. Uh, leave. <laughs> um, no, in, in all seriousness, uh, there's a lot of different situations. It really depends on your relationship. I'm not preaching that if your partner cheats, you should 100% walk. There's a lot of couples who have gone and dealt with infidelity and gone on to have a really wonderful relationship and rebuild that trust. I'm not that type of person and would never be able to do that. And um, it, But if you're unhappy in any form uh, and you've worked as hard as you feel you can and you've done the therapy and you've done the self-reflecting and you're not happy in a relationship, there is no need to stay in that. Um, there is always going to be someone who will treat you well, who will make you smile, who will give you that fulfillment that you're looking for. And life is too damn long to not have that. So for me, it was a no brainer. I mean, there was never a question that I wasn't going to leave when I found everything out, but I, I know a lot of people do stay and it gets complicated when there's kids and stuff. But for me, my happiness has always, I've always had to put that first and, um, and made that decision.